And that is why I cut my bangs every single day. Oh, hello, everybody, and welcome back to Fashion Trashin'. I'm your host, Cinnamon Charles. And I'm your host, Diamond Dumont. Today, we're headed to Cinnamon's family reunion. And let me tell you, I couldn't be more stoked. CD lost a bet we had on last week's episode of The Handsomest. No way is Bobby Buttsniff going to take it. I mean, it's in his name. He'll butt sniff his way to the top. And the winner is... Bobby Buttsniff. So since I won, D has to be my plus one to the Charles family reunion. And it looks like we're running late. We better get out of here. Let's go. Ah, the Charles family reunion. Back in my home province of Current York. When we arrived, we were quickly greeted by my almost ancient grandmother, Chili Charles. Hi, Grandma. Cinnamon, honey, why aren't you married yet? You know, pretty soon, you'll be a dried up, shriveled old prune hag, and no one will ever want you. Trust me. So nice to see you too. Aunt Chuchi. Cinnamon, darling, so good to see you, dear. You remember your cousin Chassie, don't you? Hey, Chassie. God is dead. Sure is, champ. <laughs> they grow up so fast, don't they? I'm six. Yikes. Look, it's my dad and his twin brother, Charles Rick. When they get together, I can't tell them apart. Hey, hey, how goes it? Good, you? Good. That's good. That is good. Very good. Very good. Good. It's good. So what have you got to eat around here, huh? Looks like we got some dried up room temp rigatoni, uh, some orange jiggly stuff. Ooh, some chicken legs. I can't figure out what I don't want to eat first. Um, is chicken supposed to bleed when you bite into it? Oh, cool. It's my cousin Chansey. Hey, Cinnamon. You want to take a walk? You know I do. No, what I really mean is, do you want to get high? Yeah, no, I understood the first time. Let's go. She always does that. Hey, Uncle Chevy. Can I get some of that rigatoni, please? Sure thing, Cinnamon Bun. We all know how you just love that rigatoni. You remember that dance she used to do? Cinnamon, do that little rigatoni dance. You remember that? A rap to do, a do to do, a rigatoni makes me tap on my feet. <laughs> Gosh, it seems just like yesterday. It has been 30 years, mother. Snag me some more of that jiggly stuff, would you? Yikes, dude. Are you okay? It's just that I'm, like, super high right now. Oh, yeah. That stuff really packs a punch. Not to mention, I added a pinch of cheese dust, too. Probably more of a punch than a pinch, but, you know. Cheese dust, Chansey? Cheese Louise. No wonder I don't feel so good. Attention, everyone. Attention. Cinnamon just hurled in the cheese twirls. Hey, that rhymes. Cinnamon hurled in the cheese twirls. Give it a whirl. Cinnamon's the girl that hurled in the cheese twirls. <laughs> That's my new ringtone. Listen. Give it a whirl. Cinnamon's the girl that hurled in the cheese twirls. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that is rich, silly girl. <laughs> Poor thing. Must be so embarrassing. Now that's one for the scrapbook. <laughs> <laughs> this party is awesome. And so another Charles party has ended with another jaunty tune about my misfortune. What can I say? It's like you expected. Just like you'd expect that it's time for the part of the show that we like to call Visions of the Future. Visions of the Future. Visions of the Future. What? I think we can all agree. In this day and age, it's become harder and harder to be a proper and polite human being. Because who gives a shit anymore? Am I right? <laughs> Wrong! And that's why I predict Betty Etiquette is going to be the next big trend. 
Don't think twice about playing nice. It's true. If you've been following Betty Etiquette on Gigglegram, you know she's just released her brand new digital reality experience, Ability for Civility. And now you too can pump it directly into all of your face holes. I got a copy for myself. Check it out. Hello, and how are you on this beautiful day? I'm Betty Etiquette, and I'm here to show you how you too can be your most polite self. Please, won't you come with me? Say please and thank you as often as possible in any given conversation. Please, thank you. Thank you, please. Please. Thank you. Thank you. Please. When taking a seat, always remember, a proper lady crosses her legs as many times as possible. To save yourself the future embarrassment of the time you defecated in the water closet, instead try announcing that you broke wind in the powder room. Attention! I've just passed gas in the privy. What a lady. Wow, Cinnamon, I truly feel like I'm on a path to be more politer than I've ever been. If you ask me, I think you're in for a rude awakening, D. Good thing it's the end of the show. Be sure to tune in next time where we'll be visiting the new Bro Brothers Brewery. Should be pretty fun. So until next time, folks, thanks for watching Fashion Trashin'. I'm Cinnamon Charles. And I'm Diamond Dumont. See you next time. I feel a burr breeze. <laughs> Fashion. <laughs> Trashin. <laughs> Fashion. <laughs> Talking trash.